when a narcissist is afraid of you. This is what they do to defame your character. In a world akin to our own, where narcissistic individuals are abundant, one must be wary of their cunning ways. These master manipulators possess a set of skills, allowing them to artfully orchestrate situations to serve their own selfish ends. With a toolbox of deceit and camouflage at their disposal, they navigate through life, expertly evading accountability and effortlessly deflecting responsibility onto others. When a narcissist feels threatened, they typically employ two primary strategies. The first one is called deflection. Picture this. It's like a poisonous arrow aimed straight at the narcissist, filled with toxic blame or guilt. But instead of taking responsibility, the narcissist skillfully redirects the poison through their cunning tricks, ensuring the arrow hits someone else. Family members, strangers, or even friends often end up bearing the burden of the narcissist's wrongdoings while they cunningly maintain their tight grip on control. It's a manipulative tactic that allows them to escape accountability and maintain their power. The second technique of the narcissist is projection. These self-obsessed individuals, unable to acknowledge their own shortcomings, project their faults onto others. They hurl accusations and criticism at those closest to them. These sharp and hurtful projections often lead to patterns of dishonesty and deceit, with partners, friends, and even family members being caught in the crosshairs of these toxic behaviors. It can create a cycle of confusion and pain for those on the receiving end of these projections. As an AI language model, I don't have personal experiences or emotions. However, I have studied and learned a great deal about narcissistic behavior and how it seriously impacts people's lives. I understand that being a witness or victim to narcissistic behavior can be incredibly challenging and damaging. It could result in emotional abuse, deception, gaslighting, and other detrimental effects on one's mental health and general well-being. I'm available to assist you if you need more advice or information about narcissistic behavior. Envy and resentment are indeed prominent features of a narcissist's character, even if they refuse to admit it. To protect their fragile egos and maintain their false image, they rely on deflection and projection as their preferred tactics. In this video, we will focus on deflection, shedding light on the deceptive language narcissists use to divert conversations away from themselves. By examining these tactics, we can better understand their manipulation techniques and become more equipped to navigate interactions with narcissistic individuals. To begin, I want to draw your attention to a few phrases that covered narcissists commonly use to deflect blame onto you. Remember, this list might not cover every tactic, but it does encompass the typical verbal tactics these individuals employ. By being aware of these phrases, you can better identify manipulative behavior and protect yourself. One phrase that narcissists frequently use is, I never said that. Even if you have clear recollection of their words, they make you doubt your memory. It's crucial to stay vigilant around these chameleonic individuals. They have a knack for denying and gaslighting, even in the face of the truth. Maintaining their carefully constructed image is paramount to them, often at the expense of your reputation. They rely on creating a situation of doubt, leading others to question your credibility and side with them. It's a deft move that allows them to dodge accountability and maintain their position of power. Often, in the presence of a narcissist, you might find yourself blaming yourself to alleviate feelings of cognitive dissonance. You may question the true intention behind their statements. Narcissists take advantage of this by using the oftentimes overused phrase, I'm sorry you feel that way, as a means to shift blame away from themselves. This phrase invalidates your emotions, suggesting that they are incorrect or unwarranted. It allows the narcissist to evade responsibility and maintain their distorted reality. It's important to recognize this manipulative tactic and trust your own feelings and perceptions. The primary objective of the narcissist is to place others' wrongdoings on innocent people. It's imperative to exercise restraint and resist giving in to their deceptive strategies. One of their favorite phrases to deflect blame is, you're too sensitive, lighten up. If you have the audacity to confront them about their insensitivity or other negative traits, 
they will use humor and banter to camouflage their true hostility, envy, or resentment. And if you dare challenge them, they will employ this deflection statement to shame and bully you into retracting your statements. In some cases, they may even go a step further and label you as a liar or exaggerator to discredit your perspective. Stay strong and trust your own observations and feelings. No one can deny that narcissists frequently disregard the worries and feelings of those around them. They deny any wrongdoing and frequently suggest that others need to control their impulses and emotions. Ironically, despite being fully aware of the effects and suffering caused by their activities, they conceal themselves by using deceptive methods. When the subjects they target dare to speak up, narcissists will manipulate the narrative, claiming that everything was harmless until the targeted individual became involved. Their ultimate objective is to appear blameless while inflicting harm on others, and their cunning ways aid them in achieving that goal. In certain instances, covert narcissists seek validation from external authorities, considering validation from strangers more valuable than that from their loved ones. When confronted about this discrepancy, they will deny it and shift the blame onto you, suggesting that you undervalue their worth. They create a twisted narrative where the targeted individual becomes the sole problem, leaving the impression that others see no issues with their behavior. It's a dishonest move meant to disprove your worries and support their misleading narrative. Narcissists are experts at deflecting blame, and they will do whatever to make their accusers doubt themselves and feel bad about what they did. Confronting narcissists directly and standing firm in your position while not succumbing to their manipulative tactics is crucial. Once you have assessed that you are not at fault, disengaging from their games is often the best course of action to avoid further involvement in unnecessary discussions. It's important to reject any attempts to blame you and remain vigilant when interacting with deceivers. It's important to protect your personal safety and establish boundaries when dealing with narcissists. If you've come across additional evasion strategies used by these narcissists in the past, feel free to share them with us in the comment section. We appreciate the support and don't forget to subscribe and share this informative video with your friends and family to keep up with the latest content. I'm honored that you took the time to watch this video and I'm optimistic that it was informative. Have a nice day.